And I'm Ian Gilmore. This is LOAM. Speaking of music, the LOHS bands recently held this annual Symphonic Celebrations concert. Middle school students from around the district joined forces with the Wind Ensemble. WDBC's RJ Key has the story. Over 50 schools competed in the LO Cheer invite this Saturday at LOHS. The JV Cheer team finished fourth in Division I behind Sterling Heights Stevenson, Rochester, and Stony Creek. In Varsity's Division I, they also came in fourth with a total score of 774.56. They finished behind Rochester Adams, Rochester, and Sterling Heights Stevenson. Coach Hills said she was very impressed with her girls throughout the day as they overcame two major injuries during the week. The team competes in the OAA Championship this coming Saturday at Troy Athens. The Gap Ping Pong Club has arrived and is great for students who love friendly competition as well as for those who love to have fun and show off their athletic prowess. It begins tomorrow in the Commons area at 2.45 until 3.30. It will continue on Tuesdays at the same time. You can sign up in the main office, room 251, or online through the Gap link on the high school's homepage. The JV Dragons also hosted Royal Oak on Tuesday. They won 52-43. to Mitch Howell scored 18 points and Dylan Bodigheimer added 16. We've got a full slate of games on tonight's sports schedule. The girls' basketball teams travel to Bloomfield Hills. Freshmen start at 4 p.m., JV follows at 5.30, and varsity tips off at 7. Very interesting look. Thanks, Tyler. And thank you for joining us today for the Orion ONTV Fish Telethon. The ONTV food drives have collected over 25,000 pounds of food over the past eight years, helping fish feed those in need here in northern Oakland County. The goal of this year's food drive is 6,000 pounds, and with your support, we'll reach that goal. The varsity hockey team faces off against Livonia Churchill. That game is at the Kennedy Recreation Center in Trenton. The puck drops at 4.40 p.m. And the swim and dive team has their Oakland County meet tonight at Waterford Mott High School. It starts at 6 p.m. It's really great to see new classes like that, you know, being added to help support students' interest here at the high school. And, you know, it's also awesome that ONTV has an event like this to help support our community. The JV team outscored Berkeley 68-44. to Cam Sutton led all players with 20 points, and Marlon Robinson had 10. The boys' varsity basketball team won their third straight game on Thursday as they also defeated Berkeley. The final score was 67-45. to Ten different players scored for LO. Jamie Lewis led the Dragons with 19 points. Nate Talbot scored 10, while Pierce Burke added 9. Lake Orion's record is now 9-2 overall and 5-1 in the league. All three boys' basketball teams host Royal Oak tomorrow night. Valentine's Day is coming up, and the Lake Orion Winter Guard has a chance for you to buy flowers for your sweetheart. It's their annual Valentine's Day carnation sale. You can buy them at all lunches on Tuesday next week. One carnation is $2, or you can get three for $5. All proceeds benefit the Winter Guard program. 